It is time for a new community series, Mob Seca, reincarnated in an Otome game. This is the series that you guys voted for. It beat Trinity 7. It beat Cautious Hero once again. I'm sorry. I'm sure one of these days Cautious Hero is going to be in, but don't worry because I'm going to change my community series format into two community series. We're going to do Mob Seca and reincarnate as a slime. I think that's going to be much more maintainable, but we're going to maintain the same amount of content output that I'm sure we're going to be polling as soon as you know it. Let's begin episode one. He hates me? Oh, Jesus, we already got slapped. I'm the prince. Oh, Olivia's kind of based. So he's playing the ultimate game, right? Who are you, bro? Oh, right. Olivia's like the countryside princess, right? Is he like an ultimate game fucking specialist? How many ultimate games has he played? He's straight up shitting on the fucking main character right now. But shouldn't you be playing like the other way? Like, shouldn't you be playing like Data Live fucking some other game where you are a guy going for waifus? But why are you intentionally playing a game in the press? I'll find out. Okay. You would never expect this from this guy. But okay, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Okay, super hyped up. All right. You tell that to every girl. Don't lie to me. I don't know. Yeah, why? Traveling abroad is so... F oh my god, little sister. Oh my... Who's little sister and her friend there? Oh my goodness. All right. Little sister's like in Hawaii, enjoying her life. The sister made me play it? What is the game completion audio? Uh, is this some kind of like end game stuff? Like as soon as you beat the game, you unlock some kind of audio option so you can like listen to it instead of like playing through it? Mom about you know what? What do we do? I don't know. Oh, tea party. Oh, Angelica. Because they're nobles. That's only the only thing they have. Oh, this whole thing is a floating island too? And there's like a dungeon here, huh? He's really just so sweaty with these games. He knows like everything. Oh, right. This is like mecha fighting from the trailer. Yeah. Pay to win. Pay to win. Glasses. He's really just shitting on everybody. Hey, Sudo. Long hair fanboy. Longer hair fanboy. Main character. All right. Main character as in of these like husbandos. Wow. He is just straight up shitting on everybody. So how does he get transported there? Literally day and night he's just playing this shit. And we won with the main husband though. Okay. <laughs> Reverse harm ending for his sister. What did he do? What is the threat? Oh, we're about to get hit by a fucking truck. Anytime you go to a convenience store, the truck is gonna fucking hit you on the way there. Isn't that how most decent guys start in front of a fucking convenience store or some shit? In the front of the street? Or maybe he dies from the stairs! Bro just lost two stairs. Bro literally just lost to gravity and stairs. And he's already dead and reincarnated into the ultimate game, right? Bro lost two stairs. Got a child voice actor now too, yeah. So this must be the floating island, yeah? Are we a royal or what? Mom and dad. Oh my god. She looked so fucking evil and annoying. Oh my god. Even the fucking... The look at the curls and the little girl that just want to fucking slap her. What the fuck? Is this an elf? An elf butler? All right. They got a femboy elf butler. We got Luoch over here. We got a bitchy fucking godmother and two fucking brats. All right. We're from the countryside, okay? Barkas. The bar to farto. Look at this little bitch. Look at their little smirk. What the fuck have you done in this fucking life other than get a good spawn point? You think you own this shit? Zora. Yeah, Bart fart. Huh? And you get to act like a baron? That's... Wife? But wife? Two wives. 
Married to get Baron title? But then we have a main girl? So the the the, the bitchy lady double wife situation? Okay, it's okay. I mean, damn, if we really just married to their family for family status, then we really have can't really talk back, huh? Cause you're a country bump kid. <laughs> okay, Lady Zora. Main character has a brother? Well, men aren't treated well. Because it's a matriarchy here, yeah? Okay, there's an academy. Okay. Paramore. Like butlers, like that kind of rules. This is the only isekai where being born as a human is actually bad. Because even like beast men and other like lesser folks, like they can be a paramour and become like a fucking butler or some kind of servant. They get treated better than regular men in here because men are trash in this show. Okay. All right. He's probably thinking, oh yeah, it's the ultimate game. Nani? Leon faux Bart fart. <laughs> Leon faux Bart fart. <laughs> the fuck? Yeah, this is kind of like Chain Soldier, huh? I hate this world. Ten year time skip. Bartu fartu. <laughs> this is Sid's dream from Eminence and Shadows. Sid I mean, bro, beat the game though. He should be able to win. Hmm. Now we're just leaving a living a peaceful farm pump tree bumpkin life. Alright, that's not so bad. <laughs> Bro's completely accepted that she's he's a mob. Oh? <gasps> because she owes a deal, we're getting sold off. <laughs> ah! She's 50 years old and has been married seven times. Bro, we can't do this. We're gonna get fucking eaten out and just... She gonna fucking gobble us up and just fucking spit the bones out. She's gonna go to the next fucking husband, dude. Oh, they all died in battle? No, no. How are we gonna get out of this? So she's gonna pay for it? Feels bad, man. We're the fucking third son. <sighs> Dad, come on! I, what can he do, though, huh? They all fucking married to this bitch? Mm -hmm. No. <laughs> Silence, lowly third son! Damn. <laughs> We can't talk back. A soldier, then we just die in the battlefield? Are you saying, like, before 20 is the optimal age to get married? Or are you saying, like, just as soon as someone turned 20, no one wants to marry someone? I don't know. Back in the day, they got married early, right? Yeah, you remember all the mechanics? You can do this. So if we can get the tuition money, then we don't have to do this. That is so cucked too, huh? Give me money for tuition. Can he just go to the battlefield and just like win and get money? Is that possible? Mm, we gotta riz her up. Acquired it. it. Oh, flying fish. Dude, it immediately started playing JRPG soundtrack as soon as we got into battle. I mean, this is a game. That's it? We just shoot a gun? Oh, okay. That's literally a flying fish. Okay, battle music's over. Hmm. Nani? What? A transporter. What? Where are we going? Did it just reject us? Or are we actually getting transported? I, the entire ship is fucking busted. Dad probably spent his life saving for this ship. Good job, kid. And we just got isekai again? Another isekai. Which world is this? No, it's the same world, right? 
So we got transported, but that was his goal. Weapons and magic bullets. You can just collect them? Okay, sure, it's a game. So if he clears this dungeon, maybe he gets a lot of money? Wow, there's like an electric bullet like Hajime 2 from Ari Furuta. Alright. Creepy. People die in Otome games too. <laughs> okay, research people. What are they experimenting here? Some kind of crazy lab. Luxion? Is Luxion here? The ship? The blue ship we saw on the menu screen. Okay, okay, we got our own spaceship. Pay to win, motherfucker. He already bought this, okay. So he already whaled, so technically he should still get it. So with the strongest pay to win ship ever, bro is gonna roll all the husbandos and win Olivia? Yeah, this is new game plus, dude. <laughs> Oh, no, the robot! Shoot a lightning bullet! Very familiar voice. Oh, we can cap? We can just bluff? You can't bluff a robot! Alright, we got a grenade too! Electric grenade thing! Bro just has so many weapons! No, it did not work. Here we go, phase two. Ah, shit. We're fucked. No, get in the spaceship. No, we are in the spaceship, though. This is like a guard. The robot's kind of funny. Can we befriend the robot? Is that possible? No, 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 no. Hold on. Wait, wait, wait. It's actually talking back to us, you know? Just when I said we could- Okay, never mind. So alive. Let's go, robot. Let's go. Your kind. Oh, we're different, though. Do we even know? Yo, it's gonna fucking, like, question where are we from. Maybe it's gonna be like, oh, you're so interesting. You're not even from this world. Therefore, I will help you. I don't know. We lost. A new breed. It means our old civilization was destroyed. Our old. The robot civilization. New humans. The people that like Lady Zora and all these people have destroyed the robot civilizations. Okay. We're not, we're not gonna be confident. It's gonna fucking eliminate us because we're a new human. Is that true in all Ultimate games? Is this a fucking. Like, if I played Ultimate games, I'd probably be laughing right now, but it sounds like he's really shitting on the games. Like, yeah, every setting just makes no fucking sense in Ultimate games. It's just whatever bullshit goes. <laughs> Kill our wife first. Ugh. Yo, he's actually getting squeezed. Yo, this is fucked. Oh, oh another weapon? He's got a sword? <laughs> All right. <laughs> So I guess the face is the weak spot. I kind of wanted to like befriend the robot because it was like being all sentient and talking and shit, but... Wait! Still talking? See? He is like the system of this ship. Oh, therefore you're gonna help me, or...? Luxion. 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 Master? 
Wow, okay. Here we go. Our first friend. I don't know. Yeah, oh, wait. You're going to break his reality. This sounds important. Game balance is awful. Pay to win ultimate game. It looks like he's going to die. Little sister probably came back from home and saw a little big bro fucking dead besides the stairs after grinding ultimate games for four fucking days and then What is she thinking? Okay, we got the sick pay and everything. We got medical technology in here. Everything is fine. There's no big problem. Fuck you, Zora. Okay, at least the parents actually care about him and they're sad. Three month time skip? Oh, oh, Luxion. Luxion. New ship? Yeah, pay to win ship. Microtransactions? Bakana! How did he get a pay to win ship? Behold! The power of the credit card! With unlimited cash to spend in the game in store credit shop. We got Luxion on the little orb too now. Holy shit. Okay, we got enough money to just fuck off now, huh? We don't need her help anymore. <laughs> what is that smile? <laughs> Nice. Wait, 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 wait. Is he still married, though? Hold up. Having acquired a large amount of wealth, I think... Okay, so Zora's, you know, the, the, the arranged marriage is done, but the dad, I guess, still has to kind of stay there for the Baron status. Mm. <laughs> Why are they walking in a group like that, bro? All right, let's rank them. Um, I'm not gonna lie. I don't like uh, Sudo and um, wannabe Yukimura over here. Look, look, look. I have nothing against glasses. Actually, I do have something against glasses. Glasses means that you have poor fucking genetics. I do not want to mate with somebody that has poor eyesight, okay? My offspring is not going to have poor eyesight. I'm kidding! Doesn't need to be that deep, but I just think that waifus without glasses are sometimes sexier, and that's why, you know, contact lenses exist, but... Okay. Pseudo, blue hair? Done. Low tier. Done. All right, now let's cycle. Purple, green, and blue. Purple and green are basically the same characters. They are both the long-haired femboy husbando types. And then the main character right here, the blue-haired guy, this is the typical fucking Kirito fucking main character, Isekai main character looking type, right? He's got the shorter kind of mid-length hair, leader of the pack. So I'm gonna rate uh, blue, red, last place. Uh, uh, main character, middle place, and green and purple top tier in terms of... What am I even rating? Am I rating how much I want to fuck him? I don't know. Let's just go. Oh, we got some girls. We got uh, Alice or some shit, right? Angelica? Angela? Uh, bangs lolly girl with another... I love how they're just... The boys are just bad guys, right? The boys are just bad guys. Main character, Olivia? That's it. What's well, a pretty fun episode. I think that... um. The first episode, I think that it wasn't boring, but it's not the thing that we were looking for, right? Because, like, all the funny shit, all the drama, all the ridiculousness is going to happen with the interactions with the husbandos and the other girl at the school. So, next episode moving forward, when we're actually in that school setting, it should be fucking hilarious. So far, the premise is ridiculous. It's a Gundams and battleships, and you can just buy shit and just win. The men are treated like trash. Women are reigning supreme. It's a, it's a matriarch. And I think next couple episodes, and again, like, after we get to the school, it's going to gonna get fucking hilarious so that's it hey guys if you're still here if you enjoyed this reaction please like the video check out the other play playlist for more content and until next time take care